Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome, my dear viewers, again to another episode of Morals and Minutes. I am Muhammad Ali, and today we will talk about charity. In a previous episode, we spoke of the importance of charity. We talked about how charity spans all beings, and it's not explicitly with the religion of Islam. We looked into Quran and the holy sunnah of the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, and his family, and provided you with beautiful narrations concerning charity. Allah, glorified be he, has placed wonders in charity. We witnessed in the previous episode that the Jewish man who gave a piece of bread to a poor individual as a charity which pushed away from him the tragedies of the day. Today we will continue speaking about charity and I will narrate to you another beautiful tradition of the wonders of charity. It is narrated by Abu Basir who said, I heard Imam Sadiq peace be upon him say, Jesus son of Mary passed by a group of people in a gathering. He peace be upon him said, what is the reason for their gathering? Someone answered and said, there will be marriage from this girl to this man and the wedding will be tonight. Jesus peace be upon him said, there will be celebration for tonight but mourning crying for tomorrow. Someone asked and said, why O messenger of Allah? Jesus peace be upon him said, because the bride will die tonight. They all said, Allah is truthful and so is his messenger. The hypocrites said, tomorrow is near, we will see. When they woke up, they went straight to the house to see whether the prophecy has been fulfilled or not. They arrived and witnessed that she was still alive and nothing had happened to her. They went to the Prophet and said, O Messenger of Allah, the bride that you informed us of yesterday she will die is still alive. Jesus, peace be upon him, said, Allah does what he pleases. Let us all go to her together. They went together and knocked on the door and her husband came out. Jesus, peace be upon him, said, Grant me permission from your wife so we may enter. He entered and told his wife that the Messenger of Allah is at the door with a group of his companions. She wore her veil and they entered. Jesus, peace be upon him, said, What did you do last night? She said, I did not do anything but my same routine I usually do every night. Every Thursday, a poor man would come at our door and we give him what he needs. As for the last night, during my wedding, he knocked the door more than once and nobody would have heard of him until he repeatedly knocked the door several times and I heard him. So I left what I was doing to come to his aid. Jesus, peace be upon him, said, because of the act you performed, this tragedy has been pushed away from you. This is another wonderful and beautiful story that revolves around charity. As you can see, the act of charity is an act which causes change wherein Allah changes one's outcome. If death was supposed to happen, this death is going to be pushed. This is from the wonders of charity. Let us uphold these teachings and always give in the name of Allah and not to forget about the poor man and needies. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.